Democratic candidates across Georgia have their eye on the prize as they prepare for the upcoming election. Our Arena Plunkett found out what they're doing ahead of the ballots. Every election is the most important election in our lifetime. It is the election cycle that's right in front of us, but it's the one that we have the most impact or the most that we can control and can have the most impact in at that given time. Democrats across Georgia are gearing up and going out to secure your vote in the next upcoming election cycle. That Georgia is continuing to grow and being a bigger democratic stronghold state as the party begins to work to elect to people. This year they have more people running on a ballot than I think they have in years before. With the stakes high to keep democratic candidates in office, Associate Political Director of National Democratic Training Committee Jocelyn Hunt says it all starts at the local level. But our school board elections, our city council, um, those local elections have such big impact on the things that we do in our day-to-day -day life. Um, and sometimes things we don't even realize they affect. Um, and it's so important that people know that they exist, who their representatives are, and also want to get involved and help elect people who represent them in that community. Taking a bottom-up approach, the committee wants to penetrate more Democrats into local leadership, offering running candidates the chance to learn the tricks of the trade. Everything from campaign emails, digital fundraising, and field exercises was spelled out. Driving nearly two hours to soak up all the gems, challenging candidate Micah Smith says she wouldn't miss it. Working with the Democratic National Training Committee gave me a wealth of information to help prepare me for my campaign, the opportunity to network with other Democrats doing similar things in the state, and it helps us build a stronger base that will make a better Georgia. With over 500,000 positions fit to be filled in each election cycle, Smith isn't just focused on right now, but the years to come. One of the things I can commit to is if I don't make it this time, I'll be ready for that election in 2024. Reporting in Macon, Irena Plunkett, WGXA News. Hi, I'm Jan Getchens, instructional designer at NDTC. For more, check out our other videos by clicking here and here. Thanks for watching.